Hi, Sam. John from Oregon. John from Oregon. What's on your mind? A lot of pressure, have John. Have you heard about, well, have you heard about the alien, Sam? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, oh, you mean the, okay, uh, so the hearings? Yes, the 20, July 26th hearing, yeah. I mean, yeah, we, I think we, you, we briefly touched on it, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. What's your stance on that? Do you think it's real? Do you think there's any there there? Um, no. I don't know. I don't, I mean, I, I, I'm not, I don't think there's, I, it, has it changed my mind from where I was before? No. Well, well so David Grush, he would go to jail for swearing an oath in front of Congress and lying. Who was right? the last person who went to jail for uh, lying in front of Congress? I don't know. Steve. Yeah, well, I don't know Steve either, but I know to, a right? lot of people who lied. No. Uh, there's a couple of people on the Supreme Court. Um, there's, um, uh, I mean, this happens with some regular, uh, Bobby Kennedy. Uh, we showed, uh, some of the lies that I, as far as I'm concerned that he, uh, he did under oath in front of Congress. Um, I mean, I, I don't, I don't understand why. We have whistleblower protections. I don't. I wouldn't want to deal with that. But the guy seems pretty adamant about this. Why didn't he release the classified information that he has? Is that that's illegal, right? Well, Congress, not if he Chuck follows. But not if so he follows. Out, if but hold on. Anything there? But not so if he we'll follows. Out, but. but not if he follows uh, whistleblower protocols. I mean, it's possible. It's possible. It's illegal, and he could get uh, in, in trouble for it. I just. I, you, you know, for this to change my mind, then I need to see, you know, the, the fact that he's part of the agencies that I've never heard of before now, um, that I believe he's part of, uh, you know, and that he has access to, to people in agencies that I've never heard of before now, that do what I guess he purports to do, even though Congress didn't seem to know about it. I mean, none of that seems to me to be completely implausible but it's just there's no hard evidence and let me be clear here too though the guy is a bit of a crank he said in the past that he thinks that ufos could come from another dimension that the vatican is in on a cover-up for for ufos i don't like, believe that <laughs> there's certain guys talking about Havana syndrome now too like i think yeah. it's so rich i i'm on the same boat as both of you i mean i understand both sides of it uh i think aoc asked some great questions Yes. To ask about these special access programs. Totally. And it's just a fascinating hearing. And I don't know if anyone's interested in this topic. I, I suggest I, watching. This I, I did watch AOC's Instagram on it. I don't know where where, you know, I, I, and I, I, I am like. There's definitely possibly like something going on here. If there are programs that are hidden from Congress, um, you know, it could end up being that the that the alien stuff is really more of a limited hangout. And what we're seeing is like, you know, sort of um, uh, off the books programs that contractors are engaged in. Like, I, I'm not saying that we shouldn't investigate this more. I'm just not convinced that this is necessarily we're hiding non-human uh, life form uh, or that we have, uh, you know, uh, flying vehicles from a, from a different um from uh, from a different place. I, I'm not. I I find it hard to believe that we're the only life. Yes. In the universe, uh, but I also um, I'm going to need more evidence before I take this. But I think I'm all in favor of more investigations. Great. Let's get to the bottom of this. Caller, you heard right, the. Uh, thanks the, for taking my call. Caller, I got one question for you. Actually, Wait, if you, you want to hang call, on. Are you still there? Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Um, yeah, what did you? Happy, what was? Because like I I I one thing that did stick out to me, and I had. I'm embarrassed to say the exact same reaction as Tim Poole when they said they recovered non-human biologics. And I'm like, oh, so the Russians put a dog in one of these things? Like, like, did you have the say? What did you think of with the non-human biologics thing? Because to me, that seemed like, oh, this is not alien, but we want to make it sound like alien. Well, and, and this is uh, just, to, just to be perfectly frank with you, Matt, like I've watched the News Nation interview and he said there were alien bodies. So, hmm. He, Again, said he, non -human he said non-human bodies, right? He Didn't he say the non-human? He said non-human biologics. So, like, I mean, I... In, in the hearing, yeah. Yeah. And I, I just, I'm not impressed by that. 
No, I know. It's it's weird. Thanks thanks for talking about it though. Pre- appreciate the call. Look, Reagan, man, I'm the money. Older. The problem is, problem is caller 40 slots are available, but 39 are literally tied up by majority report staff members. What? We got the MR team slamming the phones right now. <laughs> to I mean, impress I, me. I Nobody else can see the phone, the list of phones. Why would that impress anybody? I believe there's life on other planets. I do believe that. I just don't think the evidence that's been presented of, come here. of UFOs that they've come here is compelling it, whatsoever. It's just there's a lot of other things you have to rule out um, before you start saying like grays are uh, because to me it's just clearly like the 90s stuff like again like I feel like Fox Mulder I was a big X-Files fan um, but it was like clearly like in the 90s oh we had a new type of stealth bomber and stuff and maybe like type of drone technologies when you look at lights like oh look at this light hovering over the city we don't know what can do that well now we do <laughs> yeah I mean right. they're, they're pr- it's probably weapons testing and they don't and it's much more useful for people to be thinking about UFOs and not like what are we doing with our weapons industry or our surveillance yeah and like industrial complex yeah and i think you need to approach those things with skepticism especially because i think leftists in general have a very good healthy skepticism of the national security state uh but for some reason just because this is exciting to people from a science fiction perspective they abandon that I'd be um, totally psyched about it. Believe me. I'd be psyched, but me like but I need more proof. these are not reliable narrators, to 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 put it mildly. Yes, that's true too. 